Hello everybody, we we'll start with a quick snap. Welcome to the round of 64 match of the CCL Cup number 46. It's so confusing with 46 and 64. Uh, Andre and his Nurgle versus Krippy and his Wood Elves. And uh, <laughs> Elp's in the booth. Hello, Elp. Hello. Just um, <laughs> polishing off these Doritos, one second. <laughs> Fantastic. So yeah, andrew has got a pretty monster, pretty monster Nurgle team yet again. Uh, loads of Claw Mighty. Obviously the Claw's wasted, um, except if he gets to hit the tree. And it is, it, to be fair, it has made Creepy set the tree, not on the LOS. He's got a Rackle Pestigore, not terrible. Frenzy, Frenzy Juggernaut Tackle, which is a bit mental, but you know, some people like Frenzy Juggernaut. And a basic, I mean, not a basic, a decent carrier. Uh, the Wood Elves are a bit light. They've got Guard, Sure Hands, they've got an Edge 5, Stripper. They've just got a Tackle Size that Move Bust, Tree that they then put on the LOS, another Guard Catcher, AV Busted. They've got a Wizard and a Babe. I mean, he's going to have to get lucky, isn't he, Crookie? But he has got the Wizard, so he might get lucky. Yes, yeah, the wizard in hand is uh, was tasty. Just got to avoid attrition and uh, do elven things. Yes. Much harder to do with the Nurgle with the disturbing presence everywhere. That's always a pain in the ass. Makes your handoffs more difficult. It's uh, could um, be an unenjoyable experience for creepy, but we'll see how it develops. Yeah, he's certainly got a chance. Obviously, the tentacles can be a problem. Mm, yep. But also, yep. you can just roll well and dodge away with strength too, uh, as often happens. <laughs> and you know, there's a lot of blood, so it's it's easy to just dodge, keep dodging away from the noble warriors. But if he if he fails an early one, if we get an early fail, and you know that can lead to loads of mighty blow hits and. Oh, there's the 3D, gets the power. Big bang here, resulting in a KO. Yeah, there's no pile on, actually. And Andre's team isn't that good, actually. It was. It looked better than it was, <laughs> because it doesn't have a claw pommer. <laughs> I just, like, assumed the claw pommer existed, and it doesn't. Oh, 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 yeah, no, you need one of those. Yes, yes, you really do. If this rookie pester goal was a, was a tackle claw pom then uh, I think he'd be a <laughs> he'd be a big favourite, but maybe he's not even the favourite, right? Because these are only mighty blow guys. The, the claw mighty blows are only mighty blow guys. So it's not that good. He's got more tackle than you'd expect, which is two. <laughs> which isn't that much, is it? So yeah, maybe. Oh, uh, he, he must have had a must have had a death on a killer or something like that along the yeah. way. Yeah, you, you would think so, wouldn't you, with that rookie pest? Mm. Yeah, because he's, he's certainly built everybody as though they are killers. He has not gone for some off-fucking-brand tentacles first <laughs> job on his warriors. Who, who the hell would do something like that? I... yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fuck, mate. <laughs> you just don't, do you? <laughs> not even, Rick, was it? Uh, Stone Troll did it on Fumble. And, uh... Hunter's done it now. Yeah, and Chunter's done it now, yeah. Yeah, yeah. his Pommer died in the second last game. There you go. Thanks for bad. Yeah, like he had to have had a claw Pommer. Yeah. Yeah, there's no dressing up Chaos or Nurgle into like, oh, they're control teams or anything. No, they're bangers. They're fucking yeah. bangers. They'll bang shit. That's what they do. Anything else is bad because of how powerful Claw Pommer is in... Uh, I mean, yeah. he's, he's built even Nurgle Warriors. He's built Mighty Blow Claw Pommer. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's, that's every peak. Single one. That is... <laughs> That's fucking up there. So that takes some balls to do, doesn't it? To on every on every one of them. Yeah. Yeah, that's Fuck. pretty wild. Yeah. But block doesn't get USP P as fast, does it? No, it doesn't. Funnily enough, I like going mighty blow first just to get the claw piling on quicker, right? Like I, I think it's not that good to go mighty blow claw block. I would maybe go mighty blow block claw if I wanted to go. Even you know, even in that order, and even then, I still yeah. don't like it that much. Yep, yep, I completely understand it. The inducements are a wizard and a babe. 
for the woodies. It's Bo Kerry got another AV break. Oh god, he's armor six! <laughs> Holy shit, and there's a wizard! And he's got an armor six carrier. <laughs> oh, that is incredible. You should maybe. You should maybe hand off to a rookie at some point. Yeah, it's a Ricky tree as well, so I imagine... Oh, he's numbered it. It's El, uh, uh, Guido the Third. so... Glorious. Maybe he no, bought it I recently. No, I won't give in. Maybe. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Glorious, thank Thanks you. for the banging content and banger songs. <laughs> Glorious. Well, it's, it's obviously all down to Hellboy for the banging songs, but thank you very much for staying fantastic for one who will be the pregnancy. Absolutely glorious. Yeah, I've done that before as well, Nanto. But, but like, to me, it's... I mean, you do want our Claw Mighty as soon as possible to give you an out against Orcs and Dwarves, but I don't think you need to do it on all of them. <laughs> I think on all of them it's maybe a bit excessive. <laughs> but it's well, the worst really thing is when you've only got one, they fucking die. Yes. So, that's where you isolate yourself, insulate yourself against that. But that is that takes some fucking balls. And obviously he's brought the team to a qualifying record, so good on him for it. Yeah. Yeah, that takes some that takes some effort. Nurgle's one of the hardest ones to get off the ground and keep off the ground. It is. Well, the Edge 5 is stunned, so we almost certainly won't be seeing a wizard this turn. This might have been a nice turn to try the handoff to the rookie, to be honest. With the Edge 5 being stunned, I quite like I quite like going for the handoff to the rookie this turn as the as the Nurgle. Because you don't want that guy getting bolted, do you? Like he's your recovery no. after it after you get it back, and he's armor six, so he really doesn't want to get bolted. Like it's, it's like in his blood, like he's really good. Like you really don't want that guy getting bolted. But then he's control is controlling a play in such a manner that if he keeps the bolt recovery options down, might be the best uh, best option for him to be on there. Yeah, I mean if he. Strategically, sort of bangs out stuff that could actually. Well, there's okay. some strategic banging. <laughs> oh, rip. Wow. Casual 73 SPP warrior banged out by a rookie. Well, not a rookie, but you know, no mighty blow. Blockless. Yep. Not a blockless. Mighty blowless blitz. Oh, that that hurts. That always hurts as Nurgle, doesn't it? Yep. <laughs> Groovy kicked out a PI. <laughs> yeah, the Woody's and the Hidden Mighty Blow. It's something has got to be done about that, really. It's it's pretty overpowered. Oh, he's moved him. Oh, I guess, yeah, he's, he's tagged the beast. Of, the beast are these tagged. guys both in PI, are they? Yeah, I believe so. Andres. Andres. Oh, Spanish. Ah, uh, part of the Spanish contingent. Was, yeah. uh, Andre wasn't part of the... No, no, was none it? of them. None of them were. Well, no. Obviously, some of PI were part of the UC, but not Andrew. Okay. No, not not. We can't say that, chaos. <laughs> yeah, we cannot say that. We cannot say that. <laughs> oh Azawin wow! And Zergle are both in PI. Um, wow! Wow! What a turn for the <laughs> Nurgle! Oh. Holy shit! <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely brutal. Absolutely brutal. Wow. <laughs> God damn, Woody's in a hidden mighty blow plus five. <laughs> Woody's brutal. Is this guy... He must have just stood up. Why is this guy here? How is this guy here? How is this guy here? Fucking chilling, mate. I don't, don't worry I about don't it. understand. What, what is going on? This guy is stood here. How just, is he not red? Just baiting the wizard, isn't he? Just baiting the wizard. How, is, on, the, how is he stood here? Why is this not red? I don't understand. Rind it back. No, look. He's... Yeah, he's... I've got to rewind Who's, it. What the yeah, yeah. fuck is going on? No, he just paced him. Yeah, this is the start of his turn, right? Well, why didn't you just take the ball off him? Nah. What in the blue... What the actual fuck has gone on in this? Why didn't you just take the ball away? 
I'm confused as I don't understand. I do not understand. Unorthodox play. I do not understand why Andre did that and why Krippy did that as well. That is bizarre. <laughs> did I say no? Nah. <laughs> He's just two plus away. Yeah. I mean, I could, I could have just, could have just got two dice on your ball, but instead, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna dodge away. Wow. That, that was really weird. <laughs> Something so I don't think Squirrel there's collusion this game. I don't think they would collude to murder his team. <laughs> oh, yeah, that was weird, wasn't it? Anytime. Hey, you flicky walking into a lamppost. <laughs> I love that a lot. Thank you very much, Spoke Barry, for the raid. Absolutely glorious. Yeah, I would say that was grossly lacking effort, to be honest. Not not going for the not going for the a one or a two dice block with that uh, with that wrestler in contact. Very good point. Very good point. Absolute lacking in effort. The uh, Wood Elves. Hello, Sport Girl and Kay Oh. Oh, okay. MNG, okay. There we go, you see, all, all the Nurgle Warriors have done nothing and then the Randor Rotter just gets a, <laughs> gets a Kazmus next. Okay, what's happening now? Is the catcher coming in for an assist? But then, it, then it's just a 1D. I... Yeah, I... It's, yeah, he doesn't seem interested in... Winning the game. <laughs> Just wants to bang more warriors out, and you know it's it's like like getting allured by the tree to bang the shit out of that. Just moth to a flame sometimes, aren't you? It certainly seems to be what's going on here. I mean, it's not that he's given up two dice on the ball every turn, is it? But definitely last turn. That was like that. That was cr kind of crazy. The last turn. He didn't go for the ball sack. Think of the ball sack. Yeah, he's also like, does he gain a lot of space there? Doing this as he is shifting over. Yeah, he, he yeah, can shift yeah, over. Yeah, I just wonder. Gets... I absolutely sort because of, it's been a couple of times he's just banged an unskilled guy, so I'm thinking. But obviously here, there's a massive. Uh, and you want to go more central, right? So that he's got more like options. Yeah, he can to, left and right. To, yeah. To. Because if you're stuck on there, it's easy for you to just screen there, there, and there, and you can't do anything. Whereas now, you have to screen the whole width. The whole width of the field? Is he going to bolt now? Like, the Arch 5 was in prime position last turn. Now it's harder, and there's more things around, and it's just like... The bolt now looks a bit rubbish. I think maybe he's been a bit... Maybe, perhaps he's been a bit hesitant, because he could bolt. He can get in there, but he's not really going to get the ball away. With no. the disturbing presence everywhere. No. But la last turn he could have bolted. Else mm. And no, I'm not crazy. <laughs> Last turn he could have bolted. He's got an edge five ward answer. Yeah, Krippy's edge five position has been shit. Last turn was the only turn that where the edge five was in a good spot, really. To, so I thought he might have bolted there. Or he might have, you know, just taken 2D on the ball when it was fucking easy last turn. <laughs> but he didn't bother. <laughs> oh, going in for the ball now, though. Yeah. He just literally didn't bother going for the ball. And now he fails to leap in. Well, yeah. No, I think I think last turn was the, like, turn six was the turn for the wizard. Oh, well, it's still there. Lots of game left to play. Yeah, I mean, he's, he's, he's banged him. He's banged out the Nurgle quite effectively, hasn't he? He has, yeah. Yeah, surprisingly so. Regen, you love to have it, but fuck me, man, it doesn't work. It's the worst. Because you, you don't have any of the swings with the app, do you? You don't have any of the, oh, I hope it works here, and I've got to strategically use it to save this one guy. It's just there on everybody. But when it doesn't work, it sucks. Yes. And there we go, one now. Wow, wow, wow. Gammon Tiggle is getting uh, tuddy. 
A glorious tutty. <laughs> Foul appearance, I don't think, did a single thing, didn't that, that half actually? No, I don't think so. It, it very rarely does. I don't know. Yeah. The tree is just a rookie, isn't it? Yeah, there's no grab. Oh, he only had three warriors. No, he didn't. He's only got that. I didn't. I thought that was the tree. I literally thought the tree was like block guys <laughs> confirm. After just saying, after just saying that it was a rookie tree as well, and then I just thought that was the the tree skills. What the hell? Losing your touch, mate. Yeah, never had it. <laughs> Maybe fluffy burrito because they said that there's no like there's no skills for making a block, but then they're like, oh no, actually, skills that you use during a block does happen. So it's like, just it's anyone's guess, really. It's just a stupid, nonsensical mess. Yeah, you, you know, you shouldn't really be playing a game. You should just be buying the minis and painting them. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Games Got workshop. Whole Games Workshop official answer is fuck off you massive nerds, just buy our miniatures. <laughs> Pretty much. Look at all the range of paints we have. Yep. Alright, here we go, we've got the we've got the blitz. We have, but we don't have anybody to slap with really to frenzy. Just frenzy frenzy tackle. Yeah. Juggernaut tackle. But he might he might frenzy the catcher forward. <laughs> <laughs> That's a, that, it's quite a utility pesty, isn't it? Frenzy jugs tackle. Yeah, I think it's terrible. That's bad. Like, from an otherwise pure banger team. Yeah. Oh, so he does that to cut off the sidestep. Okay, that's pretty good. Yeah. I mean, that they, that's what they are, Parabell, yeah. Yeah, exactly. And good on him. Yeah. You yeah. can't argue with a share price, can you? Like, it, it certainly works for them. <laughs> oh, God. That's what I always think is funny, you know, like, you have all of these people and they're saying, oh, well, it's rubbish, and it's like, well, look how much money they're making. It's hard, it's hard for you to argue that because you think something. <laughs> when, the, yeah, when the stats say they've made low, they're making more money than they've ever made before. Yeah, and you also have the, the side-on thing of not only are they making money as well, but it's a profitable enough industry that third-party people are sitting there and they're making livings off it as well. Yeah, loads of them, yeah. And Games Workshop don't aggressively pursue them to get them to, hey, you can't do that. Because yeah. what you'd do is games, you'd buy NAF, wouldn't you, if you really got pissed off of other people using your, using third-party minis. I mean, you'd probably just report them for like being doing illegal things with PayPal, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> would be your first part of call and that would probably be enough <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't get the reference but because they, they organise events and then you, you pay through PayPal oh, yes, as a gift yeah, of course gambling events yeah. you do gift them no no you gift them you, you, they, they accept PayPal they accept pay, like they want they want pay, payment through PayPal as a gift I want as friends and family so they can't get refunds yeah you're paying for yeah but you should be paying for service right so. <laughs> I might fucking report that actually, That's, you can't be doing that. <laughs> Good old tax avoidance. Surely like NAF should be registered as a non-profit or whatever anyway, so it's... <laughs> you know, scumming PayPal out of their cut shouldn't be a thing. <laughs> well, that's what they do. <laughs> <laughs> so Games Workshop can't buy NAF because they... I mean, I don't know if that's NAF practices. to be fair, that might just be individual runners of tournaments. Uh, to be fair, it could okay, just be yeah. a little ones of tournaments rather than NAF. Let Might not be the organisation let, let me not, let me not, let me not alienate every NAF person here. <laughs> but certainly people who run, all, who run events just do it as gifts. Some of them, some of them sometimes. Yes, I, the ones that you've experienced, but yes. you've experienced uh, a small number of the total. Yes, I haven't experienced every tabletop event on the planet, and it may not be indicative of every NAF event, and certainly not the intention <laughs> of the NAF organisers. <laughs> Other tournament organisers are available. <laughs> yeah, but they're not, are they? No, they're not. Not really. <laughs> 
fuck. <laughs> Banned from Rebel and Naf, excellent. <laughs> No, of course not, Razzle. But it's funny. Yeah, it? but the, well, the thing of PayPal and all that sort of stuff is, yeah, they made a few billion, but that doesn't mean they're going to let you get away with scumming them for a few pence. They, <laughs> yeah. they want to make a billion plus an extra few pence. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Amazon made God knows how much last year, but but he'll be damned if he's not going to like give them all tags and everything so he can try throughout the throughout the, throughout the warehouse and everything. <laughs> Because it's not, it's not how it works. It's not, oh, we're happy with the money we're getting. We don't, no. no. Every opportunity to get money, we're taking it. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. Anyway, in the midst of all that, thank you very much, Andy Davo, for the absolutely massive raid. Glorious. You're watching a very interesting game that we've completely forgotten about. <laughs> to rant about PayPal and Amazon. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> Yeah, we have creepy face and um, Andrew's uh, Nurgle. No. And uh, the elves banged the absolute socks off the Nurgle early doors, and that seems to have leveled out right now. Yeah, but they didn't stop the score. They elected to not just two dice the <laughs> They decided to not take an almost free two dice on the ball. <laughs> yes, there was that. We've still got the cosmetic wizard in, in, in reserves. Yep, they've got the wizard for the next season of Cole, so that that will come in handy probably. <laughs> oh dear! And there's a KO. <laughs> yep. Yeah, the armor the armor six ball carrier on the Nurgle. Maybe that would have been a good idea to bolt or or two dice at some point, but resisted the temptation. Did creepy? Yeah, it takes a lot of discipline to do that. Maybe he's. There could be a turn where the wizard uh, has more value for you, so good on it, because it could be highly disciplined play. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh dear, I feel this, this has gone off the rails a little bit. <laughs> oh, we're okay, we're okay, we're good. Not much has happened, to be fair, in the last few turns. Nothing, no, no big true. swings, nothing. True. The Nurgler, they've got screens up. The elves look like they're pushing down the right-hand side, but they're not really getting anywhere. to roll some dice to do some things God, might have been might have been tempted by a, a very bad play leap over and then you chain push that guy free yeah yeah I would not have been tempted by that but he, he could have done it he could have done it he could have would tried this, it <laughs> would this have been my wood elves maybe yeah maybe it should have been if I hadn't just lost every game with them continuously <laughs> <laughs> the best Wood Elf team I've ever had. If I hadn't just had got one of my worst ever Wood Elf records with my definite best Wood Elf team. <laughs> yeah, it goes that way, doesn't it, sometimes? And it sucks. Oh, wow, that was real bad, wasn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six. Maybe you're running out of time and you just had a click there. Yeah, we lose that, of course, being... Uh, what, trying to replay here? Yeah. Nurgle were able to set up a probably a pretty convincing... Off screen here, aren't they? Yep, if they want to. Of course, it begs the question uh, why the hell aren't the Wood Elves dackering? But, you know, they're not dackering. They're instead choosing to get their tree smashed by Claw Mighty. And also, not two turning, you know? Yep. So it's. A bit of an odd one here. They're in a bit of a pickle. No, oh, a tree didn't get killed, that's. You hate to see it. <laughs> this is so satisfying to slap them down, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> I mean, I only can mention it because it's my fault, right? Because I have I had the rubbish record. Um, if it had been less funny, I wouldn't mention them. But they were they were a very very good team. <laughs> A very good team. To be fair, with your full commitment to elves now, and your your back playing blood bowler, pretty decent, decent amount. Um, chances of getting those types of teams are just fucking multiplied, aren't they? Because yeah. you're playing so much more, so it's good. 
That's true, yeah. I've never really played that much. It's funny, like, uh, I think, I don't know when Chunter started playing, but he's, like, played way more than me, I think. Yeah, no, you started High Elves when I streamed, when I did my bits of streams, which was, what, 2019, I think. And then you've been on and off with Blood Bowl since, but each season, generally speaking, you come back and bang about 10, 15 games out on High Elves and get them in. Yeah. But, yeah, you've not been, you've, you've, you've not had your proper focus blood bowl playing for a long time so long long time yeah about five years <laughs> like really pretty much as soon as i got partnered it's been rough i've been well <laughs> you're not the only one that's uh turned partnered and been done fuck all with the game <laughs> yeah that's true it's elk meme uh kiwi boy he's very funny he's a bit of a meme lord i uh Thank you. i got pissed off with him one time with a game when I was ill and hating it, so sorry for that help. No, that's okay. I, I accept your apology, and I, to be honest with you, I, I have a very shit gauge for detecting whether or not, you know, I should say things or... So, apologies, because, you know, I'm sure that I've not helped at times. Yeah. Although I may not have been trying to piss you off, I may have just been an innocent dickhead. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> you are welcome. Help me, an innocent dickhead. <laughs> Not just your average filing gimp. <laughs> oh, here we go. We're going. We're going down the sideline. Yeah, they they had a little probe down the other so, other one, and that didn't turn into anything. No. Based cage here, perhaps. Nice. Ooh, yeah, he's he's gonna he's gonna blitz it with the dancer, isn't he? Okay. Yep. Yep. But I mean, this Help is me. In my no disturbing opinion, presence, actually. So, yeah, using that, using that opportunity to get on the edge five dancer. Good, good. Jack player's yeah. name someone for molester. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> a mole star. Maybe, maybe it's like mole star, right? <laughs> <That's... laughs> He's named all of his players. So, <laughs> do yeah. we have any Spaniards in the chat? Could someone <laughs> let us know if that means molester? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, I hope it doesn't. Ah, oh, that's it, Kiwi. Kiwi boy. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, you, you'd imagine he'll shut this down a bit, but then, yeah, the Edge 5, he can always get through, can't he? Yeah. Well, always, if he rolls two pluses. My, my Wood Elves did struggle with that particular skill. <laughs> oh, what what team would that have been? <laughs> what team would that have been? Yeah, your Wood Elves. My Wood Elves. Couldn't, uh, couldn't do two pluses. I, I can't remember. What were they called? I can't remember. It was, it was a joke you are supposed to say about how good the team was and oh, they didn't right, get anywhere. Yeah, yeah. yeah Daka, sorry. Daka. Bit... Daka Daka was the team. They were, yeah, they, they, they were quite a good team. <laughs> but they couldn't roll two pluses. I made some uh, I made some mistakes to be honest I like this the, the the gap between so that you know if he leaps he's still got dodges to make oh yeah that he is needs another and then the extra guy as well just in case he wants to run all the way down that side yeah yeah he's got it at least oh, there we go. yeah yeah there we go there we go nice. means annoying right barely mentioned it yeah <laughs> first time it's been mentioned Oh really? Oh well, I <laughs> seeing as it's the first time I mentioned it, I might as well mention it again and see. <laughs> well, it's all about it, yeah. Yeah, I had a, I had a pretty good, I had a pretty good, uh, pretty good Wood Elf team. There was uh, two Agility Five War Dancers. There was a Movement Ten Agility Five Catcher, and uh, that was a pretty good team. Unfortunately, they really didn't like rolling two pluses. <laughs> Holy shit! Did you just see this big switch? <laughs> yeah, that was pretty nice, wasn't it? Yeah, that was that was, that was a disturbing presence though. Yeah, he's at five, isn't he? So it's still just a three plus. Wow, killed okay, the guy okay. as well. Oh, come here, what a turn for the buddies? Yeah. This is really nice. It does, doesn't it, Mordred? Yeah. You would think. <laughs> you would think. Oh, there's a there's a there's. Can you spot the way to the ball right now? <laughs> It's a bit risky, it has some GFIs. There are some GFIs. It's yeah. a bit of a space cadetting, but uh, I think you've still got to do it. 
It was a nice switch, though, wasn't it? It was a nice switch. It, it was. That was, good, that was that was. He'd done a good switch. net against the leap and everything, but um, yeah, unfortunately, this this war dancer not in the right square. <laughs> and I think he might have double GFI'd though to get there. Yeah, well, in that case, the no, he leaps, was... didn't he? Doesn't that do something with the? Well, in that case, GFIs? still the others should have been back, right? They, they yeah, should have, yeah, should absolutely, have... yeah, yeah. He was yeah, relying on the tree basically to to move. Which is just a two plus, so. Maybe you do that first? Mm, maybe. Oh, just a push. Discipline to not re roll there. Yeah. Yeah, very, very disciplined. disciplined. I'm not yeah, I mean you're hunting for the power which is never great it, but Yeah, I don't know, I'm, I'm maybe re rolling that if it's me. I think I would have re rolled that. I don't been saying that the elves. No, they don't have loads back. But he banged out. Yeah. I was thinking, you know, he might not re roll it on account of scatter. I don't know. The elves have been a bit banged out. Oh, he opens with a, a dodgeless dodge. <laughs> <laughs> Four dropping a bit of heat on you there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, 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 he's gone for the, the switch. He's gone for the old switcheroo again. Holy moly. Holy shit, making these Nurgle run everywhere. Yeah, this is like a dacker with extra steps, isn't it, basically? <laughs> he could have just daggered. Chose not to and instead do all of this mental stuff every turn. <laughs> to just try and stay in it. Still got the wizard as well. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Can he not get slapped again on the... Yeah, he can, can't he? The pesty. Yep, yep. He's just, just an instant 2D. Not even a GFI this time, just instant 2D. There's the, uh, there's the, there's the cut. <laughs> well done, guy on YouTube. Oh, that's what it is, Fant Fox. Okay, okay, it makes sense. Always costs you two pet. Yeah, even if you use one. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I knew it did something, but obviously, journeyman player. Ah, oh, thanks, Game of Vision. That's great. Well, what really endeared me to you was when I thought exclamation mark Xbox was you and first <laughs> discovered that I absolutely fucking loved it and then it turns out it was Basil. Yeah, it was Basil. Yeah, it was, it was Oh, he gets though. the pal. He gets the pal. Powers his bloody blodger. Oh, wow, and gets the AV break, which was the only yeah, way to stop the touchdown, really. I mean, not really, of course, because he might have got in range of this guy, which he did pick it up but there like he didn't need to break armor like when he when he did that hit on the catcher i didn't mind i didn't mind re-rolling that one just because i don't think he was going to score next turn was this way he's definitely scoring the next turn if you don't break av mm. just wonder when when we're ever going to see this wizard like i don't think there was the time for it uh, obviously in, in call in call next season like i said <laughs> yeah that's it <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, another KO here. Woody's doing even banging with the Nurgle, if not a little bit better, surely. Yeah, he's he's not even he didn't, hasn't even done it this turn. Like he hasn't even he hasn't even bought it this turn, so like he's just not he's just definitely not scoring. Like this this dancer could have got in, couldn't he? Yes, maybe no. he's got a post-it note covering up that bit of the screen oh, or something. No, maybe that dancer was out of range, so okay. Well, if he, if the dancer was out of range, he couldn't do it. Why is there an elf by the tree? He thought it had really stupid, so he just he just moved it to help it, and then <laughs> it didn't, it didn't work. <laughs> oh, the dancers M is seven, right? <laughs> so rude. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> he was hot and wanted some shade. Yeah, maybe that was it. He certainly got some thrown at him. Wait, hey. Wait, hey. That was, yeah, that was so fucking rude. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean, the man's holding onto his wizard, so. <laughs> oh, dear, here we go. Hey, that wizard's going to come in handy next season, Nicole. I mean, there's a strip. Oh, I guess the strip's miles away, so he, he could just. Yeah, it's gone, isn't he? It's... Yeah, okay, he's doing this. Five all time. Yeah, 
guess you guess literal it only hope you you are reduced to the fireball here. Bolt doesn't really help you. Fuck, I I don't. <laughs> There's no point doing this now, is there? <laughs> that was worth the wait. <laughs> Gets the wrestle. Wait, why did he pick that? He had dodge. The guy didn't have tackle. Oh my god, the guy didn't have tackle. <gasps> he Collusion! Because he's realised that he actually can't score. <laughs> Collusion! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, GFI, GFI, he totally can score. That is oh, not gee. best efforts. That is grossly lacking effort in the, in the playoffs. <laughs> Three season ban. <laughs> I, to be fair, my concept of grossly lacking effort and that sort of stuff radically shifted after yesterday's. <laughs> yes, yeah. No, I mean, it's yeah. just a joke. Obviously. That was just no, a joke. Obviously, yeah. That's, yeah, that's, that's... And obviously you could have just, like, just not realised, right, brain fart, if there's all sorts of things. Yeah, there is, yeah. Get a little pass here. Cheeky SPP, plus one. Yeah. Happy of that. Yeah. Might be able to get him a useful skill net. Well, tackle's useful, isn't it? Yeah. Mighty blow next. I mean, you know, we've all made mistakes like that. I think, was it PC that, like, re-rolled a POW? Or, or, like, just picked a skull? Something like that. Like, you know, and obviously, you don't yeah. really get much better than PC, so... Everyone makes mistakes and stuff. And do you know what else? Everybody hurts sometimes. Yeah. Or was it Dimmy? <laughs> did, he, did he try to surf him and then... Yeah, and then just... I know, it's triple, it's triple dice, triple dice. Yeah, yeah, three dice, yeah, yeah, because obviously you don't want to surf them because you want the SPPs. Well, there you go, 1-0. That was a surprising win. I'm I'm shocked. I'm genuinely shocked that Krupy didn't go for that, that like, 2D on the ball. It was, like, pretty easy to get 2D on yep. the ball. He could have also just, like, dropped a fireball in as well. Like, he could have yep. dropped a fireball in, and then he would have had, like... He was so dominant. It was the best chance he had, and he just did mm. nothing with it. He just ran away. It was such a weird turn, um, and everything yeah, else. It's, enough, yeah, it's it was a... It was a strange game, strange game for sure. Creepy definitely got a lot to sort of think about there. Um, yeah. But hey, congratulations, Oda Andrew. Yep. Commiserations, Creepy. And uh, thank you very much, Elmeen, for the core commentary. Absolutely glorious. Happy to be here. Thank you for having me. And thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.